No, who are you, sir? King Boo is back in with another video. Now, today we are doing the ZOMG Defend of Darling Boomer. Just doing a replay that we did the other day against uh, this guy. So, uh, this guy, Mr. Bean, is a uh, annoying grinder counter player. He plays this heli strat, which is really hard to, uh, to beat. He played Power Lock, he's got Tech Shooter and the village. I mean, you can just Maelstrom and Ring of Fire and really hurt you like that. You've got Team Tower Stun, he's got like helis and long maps this is prime map for him. He's very hard to beat on uh, long maps uh, with his strat. But uh, yeah, so a counter strat. Only problem is that you do kind of need the, um, the copy eco here. Does not work without copy eco. And uh, he, he is, the battle's TP is really glitched at the moment because he has been eco boosting I think. But uh, it doesn't show. I'm pretty sure he has been. Yeah, we copied his eco, and there's no way it was 525 without any eco boosts. So, uh, yeah. Might bug all his powers, or his eco powers at least, but I think mine are still fine for some reason. I don't know how that works. But uh, it does. And uh, yeah, so basically, you just need loads and loads of. Uh, Loads and loads of farms is the main thing. Uh, in this position, we know he doesn't have. Uh, we know he had 600 eco, so we knew we could uh, go for that. <laughs> and uh, we know he doesn't have knockout because of the strat he's playing, so we could sell our darling kind of uh, without risk of being rushed and knocked out and then being put in a really uncomfortable position. He can send some wides, but it's not really going to do anything. Uh, we could sell free farms and go for a BIA. Very nice. And now uh, camera led, just get the camera led detection. If he wants to rush us, we can just turbocharge. If not, we have loads and loads of eco. <coughs> he sends a small rush in here, we can just turbocharge, there's no problem with that. Yeah, as we said before, he's gonna send us some whites, whites are fine. Are uh, we getting ready to... Oh, I think we're just chilling. Oh yeah, we go, just farming on. Yeah, he's not played this last tower yet, but we, we're pretty sure it's... Uh, we're pretty sure it's tech shooter just from recognizing this guy's playstyle. And yeah, we're just farming on. We can almost cash out our BIA if we do that on the next round. Or maybe round 18. Let's see. Yeah, round 18 we cash out, okay. And then we go for two more BIAs to uh, really get our eco going up. He's not ecoing at the moment, which is quite strange. He sends us in a balloon. A bit of a strange player, he only plays this strat really to beat Griders, not to win games I guess. But uh, yeah, so our eco is actually the same as his and we have 3 PIAs. Now he's only got 12 more eco with his eco strat. And yeah, we're just spamming our Darkling Gunners down just so that we can defend the BFB. Which uh, if you have this many farms, the BFB defend is really easy. <laughs> I can get a laser cannon as well, just to help a little bit more. It's going to turn into BFB, we now overtake on eco. He goes for an Apache. I guess he didn't think we could defend the BFB. For some reason, maybe. We get our, our three turbochargers at the end. And three turbochargers defend BFB. As long as you pop down the BFB layer to Moabs. And damage the Moabs a little bit. Now we just need loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of Darling Gunners. We need many, many Darling Gunners to pop this ZOMG layer. I saw rare. Uh, one unnamed source earlier try and tell another unnamed source to get loads of turbochargers but you don't turbocharging you're gonna need some turbochargers at the end you're gonna need like five turbochargers at the end but you're not gonna pop a ZOMG layer with turbochargers kind of ridiculous you need loads and loads of darling gunners and we've got so much we have like we can go for a ray of doom as well we have a ray of doom on round 23 which is kind of cool which helps a lot with uh we're down these ZOM, ZOMG layers. We did have to sell two BIAs, but it's not really an issue because uh, we're defending this, which is the main thing. We still got one, and we have loads and loads of eco. And there we go, nice and easy to defend. Sell all the boomers, get the BIAs back. I'll we'll get a BIA back, then we get more over time. He doesn't send us in another one though, because he knows we can defend. And yeah, now we've just gone back up with BIAs. I'm in a very nice position because we have out ecoing. We know his strat doesn't go very late. Oh, it doesn't go 
I mean, now with this position here, it doesn't outlast us. Or it could. We don't have a. Well, it only outlasts us actually because of the damage boost, but we have still got our Super Balloon Boost Team Tower Stone, which we just have chilling in the back. Oh, he's now egoing again. He's still not going to catch our eco though because we have so much ego. Uh, around 27. Those mobs are getting wrecked. We've got our four BIAs back. He stopped egoing. He's playing very strangely. He's going to send us another ZOMG. So uh, the COG defend was way easier because we have so many. Uh, we've got more uh, powerful, uh, faster spinning barrels on our tiling gunners. And we go for a second ray of doom. And look how quickly we pop this ZOMG. There we go. I don't think we even needed. We didn't even need turbocharges for that one. <laughs> That's how easy that was. Two ray of dooms and a load of faster spinning barrels. Very easily popped at ZOMG. And then yeah, so that hurts Eco more. He doesn't really have much. He has 20k saved up and two Apaches and a village. So he's really not got much at all. So we have 50k saved up, five BIAs. And we're like, yeah, let's rush him now. Even though, just because I didn't really, I didn't know his Eco at the time. I didn't feel like he had much Eco, but I wasn't 100% certain. If I could send so many ZOMGs in. Uh, I just decided I'm not going to defend these. I have speeding up powers, so... And I sent first, so he yeah, doesn't stall. So I know it's in a good position. If I just defended here, I only sent two in, I could have easily defended these. And one, because uh, Ray of Dooms are uh, pretty cracked against Moabs. But yeah, Team Tower Stun, which got the stuff pushing. And Screen Lag, but he got pushing so far. And then he just eventually, eventually, you know, after a great many hours, went down so yeah that's how you outlast heli village with the darling boomer nice and easy uh, yeah might pump out a few more videos after this one as well started playing the game again last week and yeah it's the leaderboard oh nick overtook clobophobia no way he he's like apparently choked first place like loads of times so uh he does it again Oh, JL is back on the grind. He's got his lead back on landing. Hopefully, he clutches up that third place. But uh, yeah, it's going to wrap up the video. Uh, hope you have a, a nice day. And uh, yeah, see ya.